Hello everyone, thank you for checking out today's video. In this video, we're going to be covering how to release your personal developer instance on ServiceNow, as well as being able to clear out the information on your personal developer instance on ServiceNow and returning it to out of the box. Now to accomplish either of these two things, you need to head over to your developer homepage, which is at developer.servicenow.com. Upon signing in, you'll be brought to a screen similar to this. And to accomplish either of those two instance actions, you need to select your profile icon in the top right. The first one that we were talking about was release instance. So once you select that, it's going to ask you to provide a reason. So you just put whatever your reason is. Then you go ahead and hit release instance. It may take a moment, but it'll give you a prompt to let you know your instance has been released. And if you want to come back and create a new instance at a later time, all you got to do is come over to start building. And when you select that, it's going to ask you to select the release that you want. And then uh, just wait a few minutes and it'll create you a new instance. Now, let's say that you want to keep your instance, but you just want to clear out the data, get it back to out of the box. If you come down here to reset and wipe, it's going to go ahead and give you some information here. It's going to say this will reset your instance to out of the box settings. You will also receive new instance login credentials after the reset is complete. It's going to ask, do you want to keep your, your name, your instance name? You can decide if you want to keep the name or you can just do no, give up my instance name and get a new one. Go ahead and hit the checkbox there and then hit the reset and wipe instance option. And it is that simple, guys, to either release your instance or to reset and clear out your instance. instance. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving this video a like. Please also consider subscribing to the channel and I'll catch you all in the next video very soon.